morning guys how are you all doing so today is Wednesday um, Monday it rained all day and I'm so glad I decided just not to go because I had that other walk last weekend so I didn't want another rainy walk so I didn't go yesterday because it was still a bit grey and rainy today it says it's a clear day and I feel that it is one so I am off on my planned walk which today is Rainford now that's not Rainsford in Essex this is Rainford in Merseyside and it's um, a bus ride halfway and then it's a train ride the rest of the way because it's still in Merseyside I can still take a free train so I'm going to do that today as a little bit of a treat the place I'm going to is a heritage I think it's like a rail heritage centre anyway where you get off is where you start walking at Rainford um, and so there's a circular route I can do which is a nice bit of a hike about two hours long I think all in all so I'll go and do that and video as I go along as I do and hopefully it will be a good day for a walk um, so I will catch you all later have a good day <laughs> so I've only got one Stop Rainford. Welcome aboard this Northern Service to Blackburn. We will be calling at Rainford, Up Holland, Oral, Pemberton, Wigan Walgate, Hindley, Daisy Hill, Hagfold, Atherton, Walkton. What was that? Swinton. I really do wish it jarred it. Oh, Central, does it? Well, because Manchester, I have known him before, it sounds fine to me. Rockdale, Why don't you like Smitty it? Bridge, Littlebrack, don't you like his Tottenham, accent? <laughs> Burnley, Manchester Road, Rose Grove. Oh, is it? Oh, that's not good, is it? Blackburn. <laughs> <Blackburn. Blackburn. Blackburn. laughs> so is he trying to sound sort of more... More Yorkshire than he is. Yeah. Even though he's born in York. Yeah. Okay. He's just doing it for making it sound more Yorkshire. Well, I'm a Londoner, so I don't know much difference between once once I get up. Well, I mean, I, I live in Liverpool, so you know, I got that accent. I live with that one, which, yeah. as we know, is a very strong accent. You can't miss a Liverpool one. Okay, main junction. Go for me. Walk. So this train station is really out in the middle of nowhere. Which is just so cool. And hopefully I'll be able to catch a train back later on. 
you worry a bit because sometimes these big trains that are going to somewhere particular like Blackburn don't stop if they're late. They don't stop at these small stations. This is a really small station. Okay, I've got to come off in a minute because I've got to get Kamut up and find out which way to go. Oh, look at that parked bike. Brave. That's me walk down there. Just having a look to see how he's just parked his bike. Can't just have left it there, surely. Oh, there's no lock on it. It's a nice little bike. Trail bike. Okay. Just going to check the back in a minute. Right, so it seems what I've done is I've put it in to go the other way around. So basically I've got to walk down the road first and then walk back to the train station. Um, turn left in a bit and walk the other way around. Well, that's okay. I'm sure to get lost. <laughs> oh, I am so sure to get lost, but in the middle of nowhere. How about that? Having a walk, you're having a cycle, oh, yeah, and I'm bidding you all so enjoy. Morning. Natives don't seem particularly friendly around here. Hey ho. Maybe they're just fed up of walkers walking past. So I'm not sure if this is right. Just seems to be a dead end road. Mm, goes round in a circle. So maybe it's okay. Okay. I have found my path. So, this is a new path that I've got too. So I think it's very close to the railway station. It's going behind these houses. I used to have a lock up like that. The end of our road, a whole bunch of them. Always worrying about people breaking in. People still use them. They still park their cars in there. So I think this is where I would have crossed. Oh no, this is probably the way I want to go actually. I'm going to have to look on Kamut. Wait a second. I can't fathom Kamut out, so I'm going to cross over and have a look. And see what happens when I cross over. I mean, it can't be down there, can it? Maybe it is. Watch out for trains. So I'm just going to... 
Oh, look at that for a line. Straight as an arrow. Um, so I'm just going to have a quick look at <laughs> be a good idea if I opened it the right way in it. I'm just going to have a quick look at Kamut now because I've crossed over. It's just very, very difficult to understand what it's telling me. Um, but I've always struggled with stuff like that. Anyway, I'm just going to go down these steps here and I'll come back in a second. Just got to look at Kamut and see what it tells me. Okay, so this is wrong. This is a short walk. I could do this. I could do that one, but it's very short and I've booked a long one, so go down the street. Back again. So I'm gonna go down that street. work out where Kamut wants me to go. So there's nothing here. It's just a street. The playground obviously. So I'm gonna walk down here a bit. See where it goes. I knew I'd get lost. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have a quick look at Kamut now and see what it says. There's a path over there. But I don't think it's right. I think I've got to go down here and um, cut off, to keep on the main road for a bit actually. So we'll see where it goes. I'm lost. Okay, can you see that? Springfield. Now you can see that on the commit map. So I really can't see where you go across on that path there. I don't know where that goes. I don't know what it means. So I'm not kind of going to cross. I am not going to cross. I'm not going to cross a park to have to come back. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go around here and go down this other road. I can't remember what it's called now. Don't mind me. I'm trying to work a route out on Kamut. It told me to go across that playground down there, but I couldn't work it out. So I'm going down here now. I'm just having a walk from the round, round in a circle back up to the train station. So, you know, so I thought I could do it, <laughs> but I always get lost anyway. I'll find it in the end. I, how are you? No, I'm coming back to that later. This is my walk for the day. So.
Morning. Try not to get run over, eh? <laughs> Thanks, Del. So I just talked to this fellow who's walking his dog. There he goes. And this is the lane I want, so that's where he's walking his dog. That's where I'm going in a minute. Just give him a chance to get his walk on the way. So he doesn't feel like I'm following him. Bus stop there. I wonder what buses go from here. I actually pinned the speaker just inside my shirt, which when I'm out in the middle of nowhere, um, it's just fine, nobody can see it. And in fact, when I was on the train and some other bits and pieces I took videos of, um, hopefully the sound will come out, so we will see. Anyway, I am going to go left down here now and see where we end up. I won't video the house. That's someone's home. I'm sure they don't want to have whatever where they live on the video. Oh, look at these mushrooms. Wow, look at those. Toadstools, aren't they? Fairy ones. It's, it's windy but warm this morning, so it feels like an autumn day. It feels really nice. Sun's out. The wind is warm, as I said, and I look just looking at the hedgerows and that. I feel like the blackberries will be coming out soon, unless they've come out already. I'm not quite sure when they come out nowadays. They tend to come out. I always thought it was the autumn from childhood, but I'm not quite sure anymore. I've seen them out at different times of the year now. So, I'm sure one of you will tell me. There he goes off in his walk. And I'll catch up with you when I get down to the bottom. So, if I followed the pathway, then that's it to the left. The park is through those trees there. There was that little bit that I pointed out, so that must be it. And that must be the little pathway I should have come down. Well, there you go. I wonder if you could have walked it. Let's have a quick look. It was pretty overgrown. I know, I know, I've got to go right. I'm going to go right. Just wanted to see how walkable it was and whether people actually walked it. Yeah, looks like you can do it. So, I'll know for the future. So onward with this path, which is a quite a nice big one. Got houses backing onto it and everything, so <laughs> summer summer barbies you think, yeah? Summertime sitting out. It's be glorious. Yeah. Must be absolutely glorious living here. So quiet. Okay. I'll walk on a bit, see how we go.
Can you see all these buzzy bees? Collecting pollen. I don't know what they are. They're small. They would scare me because they're almost waspy sized. But they're collecting pollen and they're very, very busy. How about that? All right, fella. There you go. Are you busy collecting your pollen? Them all busy, busy, busy. Okay, so I've got to cross over here and go down that lane there. I'm not risk anything. Scalmerdale, Scalsmerdale and Southport. I beat that lolly. <laughs> <laughs> I can beat that line. Okay, down here. Oh, what was the saying about blackberries? Well, they're definitely dead, so that tells me they've been and gone. No. The red ones there, but nothing to write home about. Okay. So there's this complicated bit coming up and I've just shown you on the map on my um on my screenshot. And I think I don't go down where those people are coming up. I think I go left before that. They're going off to their right, which is my left. That may be the path that I want. It's sort of squiggly, isn't it? Ooh, look, a book. Bit of a building here, isn't it? Franklin and Sons Precision Engineers. That's rather sad and unloved now, isn't it? All locked up. Oh, they're going into the car park. Okay. You can see it's a car park there. So I'm going to come off and go on to commute now for a minute to find out where I'm supposed to go next. Because there's this pass here. But I don't think I take that. I think I'm going left. Maybe I am taking that. I've got to have a look. So I don't know if I go on a bit further. There's a path here. And there's a path there.
Okay. There's a couple of paths in the car park. <laughs> We've got loose in the car park, but they're all locked up. Let's pick the area. This was a cafe at some stage in its life. Hello. Okay, let's have a look at the top of these stairs and then I'll look at Kamut and see what it's telling me. I don't think it's right. I think I've got to go along the path a bit more and turn left further down. I'm just going to go to the top of here and have a look at Kamut and see what happens. To the little red dot it tells me I'm going wrong. <laughs> I think it's just picnic area here. So if any of you want to come down here, little picnic tables. Look at that. Ooh, it's muddy. Nice in the summer, I reckon. Huh? So, looked at Kamut, this seems to be the right way, so I'm just going to walk down here a bit and double check again in a minute. See, that was the other walk up that says picnic area in the car park. But I think that's the car park. So I think I've got to go up here, which is paths that I used to walk well with my doggies because I knew them. This is a sort of path that I can easily get lost on. So, so another quick look at Knut and see. It's telling me. Now, quite honestly, it's not really a path, is it? If you know what I mean. It is, and it isn't. So I'm going to walk along here. And um, see that? Those tree trunks, whatever they are. I haven't got my glasses on. Oh, it's a bench, sorry. So that bench there definitely tells you so this is a a walk along path so hopefully i am going in the right direction oh some steps here okay no it's not steps i think it is yeah steps ah this is a path in a bit isn't it I like this. This is the sort of walks I used to do with my doggy and my doggies before that. I had two together at one time and then I just had my Cassie dog. So if you can see the yellow through there, that must go back to the car park as well. 
And I think that may be the one that it was going to tell me it was. I was going to have to go down if I carried on down that path. Anyway, going to have a quick look at commit. So I stopped to do my shoelaces up and put my phone on there and it slipped on there and then it slipped in there. So I've just been panicking and drying it off quickly. Um, so hopefully all good. I think I'm going left there in a minute. Lady with her doggy. She was very kindly came and brought me some tissues when she saw what I'd done. So yeah. Idiot. What's that? Oh, whatever it was. Sign's gone now. Mm. Quite honestly, I think that was probably the way I was supposed to come to avoid. It told me where to go left. I'm going to go up here a minute. No, I think it's here. I think it's here. I'm going to get Kamut up in a second. I'm not quite sure. Let's see what Kamut says. Oh, because I'm lost and confused again. No, I've got to keep following that other path. That does go back onto a path, but it says this way, so I'm going this way. So there's supposed to be a path here when I get to the end of this bit. I have got my um, battery charger, you know, the brick, block, whatever you want to call it, my anchor to charge up my phone today. Oh, there's a path with water down there and a bench. That must be another path that you can take. But I'm taking this one because that's what Camus says. Oh, look, conkers. <gasps> oh, do you remember conkers? It's very soft, it won't open. <laughs> Oh, I used to love conkers. Don't know whether you're allowed to play with them anymore. You know, smash them against each other, try and kill each other. It's all health and safety now, isn't it? Oh, conker tree. Oh, there he is, look. You can see him. Let's see if I can get a close up. There's your conkers on your conker tree. It's funny when you look through the camera you can't actually see it but when you look away from the camera you can see it and I'm trying to see if I can show you where they are but maybe when you if you've got a, f a thing that you can bring the, the video in you'll be able to see it but there's two on that branch up there okay 
following this path to somewhere. Now, this is where Kamut said I had to go something different. I think I have to go left here at the bottom. But I think I'm not going that way by the pond. I'm going to have a quick look at the pond. I think I'm going off to the left there in a minute. How about that for a pond? It's very stagnant, isn't it? So I'm just going to check come out. I'm going the wrong way, <laughs> the wrong way, the right way now. Yes, it seems I am. So I haven't got to go far down here before I get to a proper path. Um, hill. That goes down here onto a path. So this is nice, nice bit of field here, bit of sun. I've just got to follow this for a little while, although well, I'm really enjoying it. Ah, oh, these are such the walks I used to do with my doggies, I used to love them. Yeah, I'm telling you, I could walk three, four hours more, some days I just go and park somewhere and we'd walk forever. Look at that. That is so pretty. I can see a man with a dog in the distance. I don't know if you can see him. I think we're right by the train line. <laughs> okay, I've gone wrong a bit because Camille says I should have gone. Another path here somewhere. So I'm just going back to this bit that was uphill because that was the bit I was supposed to go up because I'm confused now. Oh yeah, this is right, look, come up to the railway track and it's got a green sign to tell me it's nice and clear, so remember to always close the gates properly, not just for other humans but for mainly for doggies that might push it open, so it says it's clear, so crossing the railway line again, I knew I could hear the railway come past, should we stand here for a few hours and see if we can wait for a train to come through? Okay. I'm getting to learn commit now. As long as I keep checking that red blob. There we are, just come down there.
and we're going to walk this field now so I'm going to turn my camera off till the end of the field because I really need to put it on charge for a while okay guys catch you in a bit Okay, just as we go past, have a look at this big black cow. It's actually a car driving down here at the moment, but hey-ho, we're not doing anything illegal. Someone can move that. <laughs> I think they're coming out for a shoot because there's like a bunch of them coming down. Hello cows, there's baby cows in there as well. Yeah, look, babies and mummies. Also, how are you doing? Are you a mummy cow? You look big for a mummy cow, but I suppose you are. Well, that was interesting. Um, I don't know if you can see them all going down there, but basically I stood out the way to let them all come down. And some smiled and waved, but there was a couple that really scowled at me. So I stopped one guy and I said, look, when you all meet up, just tell them I'm out for a walk. I'm just following my canoe and I'm out for a walk. So I think they're going off for a shoot, but oh, they were panicked, I tell you. It's wrong, isn't it? Can't come out for a walk now. Little old lady coming out for a walk. Yes, of course, I have a bunch of police cars turning up in a minute as I get to the main road. That'll be fun. Okay. This is where I'm going to sit for a while and have something to eat. I've got to turn you off again because I'm really low on battery. And I'm really low on charger battery as well. I didn't check it before I came out. I thought it was full, but it's not. So, catch you in a bit. So I'm just going to phone video this little bit before I switch it off again just to show me climbing over the gate if I have to because I know you would all find that quite funny. Oh, 
Hi, Dom. You all right? Yeah. I saw you carrying your doggy. Is he all right? Yeah. Yeah, my doggy did that a few times on her walks. She doesn't look in pain anyway, so hopefully she'll be all right. That's all right. I'm glad you only had to get back to your car. Okay, so up to this main road and I think it's left again, but I've got to look at Kamut. So that was interesting. Walk. Quite enjoyed that. This is the road I've got to follow for a bit. And I will keep going. Oh no, give it its freedom. So this is Linear Park. It's a bit dodgy around here at the start, but hopefully it'll be okay. So, just about to go through some gateways here, so I'm pretty sure this is the end of the walk that I am coming to.
and I can't wait to get on a train. Probably got an hour or so, God knows, to wait for a train. But as long as I can sit down, I'll be happy. So it's been a really good walk. And here it is, and I think this was where I was thinking I was starting, but actually this is where I finished. Did I cross the road to get my train? I got one plate. We had to do that when we came in. Don't really know what they stopped for. And then it stops and parks up. So guys, home now, it's 25 to 5, I actually got home about, I don't know, half an hour ago, but I had to have a cup of tea because I was gagging. So this walk today, the best yet, loved it. Walked for nearly two and a half hours, two hours and 25 minutes I think it was in the end. Um, so it was really, really good, did five miles, which doesn't seem that much for two and a half hours. But it felt it on my legs. They achy, achy now. But that was a brilliant walk. Really loved it. I've got loads to upload, so I'm going to get on with that now. Some interesting things I came across as well. So it was a very fun walk. Glorious day. So really good. So I'll get this all uploaded for you. And you'll have watched it by the time you get this bit. Because... I'll be putting this at the end of the video so um, I'll add in my 
my walking steps as well, my pedometer thingy. So that's the most steps I've done on my walk so far. So building up, building up. Yeah, can't wait to get out of there. Okay, see you soon.